Okay, uh, just have draw your super uh, red dots like that. Why? Just for fun. <laughs> you got something with your spelling and bone, and sometimes it messed up the, the visual system. So you gotta hold that in front of you. Just look at the dots here, okay? In front of you. Keep your eyes straight. Um, tell me if eventually, if you look straight, you should have. But if you one of those dots getting clearer, starting to be uh, less red, starting to fade away a bit. The left. That one? Starting to go away? Yeah. The resting. Okay. So it's on both sides. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay, perfect. That's good. So we keep it that way. So it took about a couple of seconds. Uh why did I do that? Yeah, the uh, stability problem on his um, right uh, uh, neural subsystem. If you, uh, bend, it's related with actually with this uh, diaphragm. The diaphragm is connected with a lot of structure in the body. We test seven of them. If you uh, bend your knee a bit, okay, just keep your breath breathing. I'm gonna push you. Resist. If you keep his air. He's like tightening himself, okay? But if he's losing his air, we create a movement with the diaphragm, he might lose it, okay? So breathe in, breathe out. So my, meanwhile, <laughs> he's creating a new movement from the inside, he's losing his strength. But what is gonna happen if I gonna um, tackle. tackle you? Yeah, exactly. Your breath is gonna change because you, you're gonna see something. You might surprise or yeah. to absorb. And in that posture, when he lo he's losing his air, he's breathing out, he's losing his strength, his stability to stabilize himself in space. On that side, the other side is good, actually. Okay. So breathe in, breathe out, resist. That's good. Breathe out. And the other side, even if it's upper or lower, breathe in, breathe out, resist. Look, I'm pushing with my thumb. Oh, that's what I'm not. I'm not tackling him, okay? <laughs> so, uh, I, I found something with, with, with the structure, I won't tell you everything. Eventually, we, we give course about that, but his sphenoid bone is upper on the right side at the moment, and his eyelid bone is problematic as well. Eyelid bone, uh, what I can tell you is the end of your uh, diaphragm, um, con a link connection, actually. It's the, the end of your uh, diaphragmatic tree, breathing tree. Okay. <laughs> Let's go to the L tree, the third lumbar, and that bone here, which uh, if I uh, block it, you're gonna see the hair won't be cool, huh? <laughs> no. Wanna, wanna try something? Do an uh, upper lordosis here, and extension of the head and breathe. Let me see how it is, it's not super cool. If you do the opposite, bring your breathe like that, so you're creating Less distance between the two of them is way easier that way, huh? right? Yeah. Okay. So just an experience that we, you can have uh, with your diaphragm. So uh, okay, he's like, I'm training my diaphragm. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're not. Okay. So uh, do you have Halloween just to put a little pressure on your spinning bone on that side? Yeah. Cool. You have hair, or you're like Greg, or no, 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 he's got plenty of beautiful hair. <laughs> Everyone in the team got the pro hair problem, you know. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna push it. Relax here. Relax. Breathe in. Breathe out. Relax. Keep going. Relax. Okay. Good. Okay, yeah. okay. Left here. Push up. Top. Rock and roll. So <laughs> the other part you're gonna do is to reset your eye bone, uh, which is connected to the. Um, um, I'm seeking for my word in English. Uh, the, um, the muscle homo iodian uh, muscle, which is, is the only one attached to the, uh, actually is the one attached to the bone, but that, that bone has got a super neural charge since it's not connected to any other joint, is alone suspended with muscle. So you're gonna create, um, gonna go under your jaw here, just push your bone here in front, flat, 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 okay? Might be sensitive a bit, if you want me to do it first. So you glide here and you feel the bone here. Yeah. Just make a quick reset like that. Do it ten times. Up. Oh. 
sensitive a bit. Mm-hmm. Some, sometimes the lymph is, uh, lymph nodes are blocked. You have COVID. <laughs> <laughs> immune, immune. That's good. Perfect. Ten. There we go. Swallow. Push up here. Awesome. That's good. Okay. <laughs> Bend your knee. Breathe in. Breathe out. Resist. Oh shit. Mm. And I go in more. Okay. Breathe in. Breathe out. Resist here. Okay, good. <laughs> so that was the easy part. The second part was my was a personal challenge for me, just to see if we got the difference for the eyes. Hold it, same. Fix it in the center. Check if maybe sometimes you see the dots clearer. Actually, it's different, and there's no fading over time. We more see it with the palate actually, but I was uh, curious to see if we got any change here. No. Still fading on the left side. No. No? Oh, not really. No, that's the same. Yeah. That's really interesting, huh? <laughs> so you got the side problem coming from your spin- spinal bone. Who's checking that? No one. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, uh, Vimas uh, Neurotherapy. Uh, so have fun in the new era, we got some course, more more to come in English actually, but we did definitely need to uh, use neurotherapy for uh, athlete and that's what we change. Yeah. <laughs>